This is my Traxxas Raptor RC car, two-wheel drive. That's it in the box as it comes. And that's getting ready to do a uh, configuration. This is the original configuration of the receiver, electronic speed control. And I'll be modifying that to add my 3D Robotics autopilot system to this and using the flight planner on the computer to be able to run a totally autonomous mission. No intervention of the operator. You just flip the switch and the vehicle does what it's programmed to do. Again, this is a two-wheel drive and it's set on its uh, speed for learner position or half speed so it, it doesn't really go real fast in this auto mission and um, it's quite a good looking truck okay this is the modified version that's the receiver the electronic speed can um, the autopilot, the GPS receiver, and the transmitter for the computer system. All I did was unplug the old receiver. This is the high-tech transmitter that allows me to do multiple channels. And that is an Optima receiver, 8-channel receiver. Okay, this is the Raptor by Traxxas with all my electronics in it and uh, this will show you what we got It's a fully automatic autopilot, can do autonomous missions, and it can be programmed with the computer. And here's the computer, and that's the uh, mission planner. And you set it up any way you want to, to have some fun. Okay, this is the Raptor, Ford Raptor by Traxxas. It's out on the road, sidewalk, and it's getting ready to do a programmed autopilot mission, go to 17 waypoints, and perform a function, and then return to home and end the mission. Okay, I'm ready to start the mission. I can program it from my transmitter to uh, start. And uh, We'll just video it and see what happens.
Okay, it found all of the waypoints, 17 of them. It ended its mission. It's ready to just be driven manually now. And that's the venture of the Traxxas uh, two-wheel drive Raptor with an autopilot added. This is the before and this is the after modification and change.